Today is May 1st. We are out looking for morels and pheasant back mushrooms. My son Ryder found some right here. I made a video about this last year. I'm going to make one every year just so people see it and, and they're updated on it. This is a pheasant back mushroom. There's actually two of them. Yeah, there's two of them here. Hopefully you can see it looks like the back of a pheasant. And when you smell the bottom, it is going to smell like a watermelon rind. We have one right here that's fresh. Oh, Hawkeye, can you hand me that? <laughs> My son just dropped it. It looks yummy. Here's what the bottom looks like. Hold it still right there, son. Okay, it's nice and porous. Ryder, do you want to go ahead and, and harvest these two that you found? Yeah. Okay, be safe with this, please, okay? Make sure you don't cut yourself. Do not cut yourself. If you do, I'm going to look for some. Try to cut it by the stem. To see here? if it's like... Nope, nope, cut it by the stem. The stem, son. Down in there, yep. And if it goes through easily, that's, that's going to be... Yeah, the parts of the mushroom that your knife passes through easily, that's the part that you want to eat. You can use the hard part... Uh, for like a soup stock. Is it cutting through, son? I don't know if it's through. It's probably hard because there's like two. Yeah, there's two of them there. Oh, plus you're going through the trunk. Here, you could just grab it too. Yeah, you might be able to just grab it. Watch out, don't cut yourself. Move the knife out of the way first. Here, sure. let dad hold the knife. Let me grab I take my kids out and we learn how to use cutting tools. It's important. Oh, it looks like it's cutting. Is it gonna break off? Um, it's kinda hard. It's because it's in the. It's like, it's uh -huh, I got it. I need to Okay, John, watch out. He's gonna I actually go through the bottom. Go through the bottom, then. Yep. Yeah, that should be easy. Good, Booyah. good, good, good. Okay. Yay. Can we get the other? Sometimes on that stem, you'll oh, see some God, black rings. Oh, there's actually three of them. There's three of them. Are okay, we'll grab the other me? one. We'll take them home and use them. Are you so holding? Ryder, it? yeah. Uh, Katana, go ahead and hold that. Ooh. You see, my kids get very excited here. Back, Daddy. It smells like watermelon. It smells like watermelon, Ryan. Good. I think the bigger ones have smaller pores. Not sure. We'll have to check. Because it looks like... All right, now listen. We're going to leave that bottom one there. Let that one grow. Here. Okay, you can also Here's see on that stump by Katana's leg there, there's Here's a baby the one. one. We don't want to We don't take us. everything. We only take what we're going to use. We don't want to kill this baby. Um, cool. I'll try to find some recipes. Here, let me see that right. Let's get a close-up of it. You can see it looks like the back of a pheasant. Very easy to identify. Another name for this is Dryad Saddle. Smell good, Tana Bear? It smells good. I want to keep smelling it. <laughs> Tell you know what? You could have that one. Yeah, it does smell like watermelons one. out here. This reminds me of the watermelon. So this is pretty cool. This is our first mushroom hunt of the year. And so far, we've we've found a decent, got a decent score here. All right, I'm going to go ahead and sign off. You doing okay over there, son? Yeah, just some... turning into pheasant back. Oh, okay. I'm not sure what sound pheasants make. Um, yeah, I'm going to go ahead and sign off. Thanks for tuning in. Let's get one more picture. Let's see the one you got, Katana. That's what they look like. All right, thanks for tuning in. Semper Fi and God bless.